everybody, it's Missy with Shimmers again, and today I'm going to show you a fun technique that you can do with embossing. And if you recognize this machine, you probably have one. It is a cuddle bug, and it's been sitting on my shelf for forever, and I thought, you know, I'm going to use that and try it with some of my Shimmers products. And so I'm just using uh, some cardstock here that's meant for a card, and it's... Um, not very thick it's it's pretty thin and I just embossed it with this embossing folder that looks uh, like a tree trunk it's wood grain so to toughen up my paper a little bit I'm gonna add some clear gesso and I'm just gonna smudge it with my finger here and it's gonna give my paper a little bit more thickness and a little bit more texture for my paint to smooth around when I start to paint it so it's nice and dry and I'm gonna be starting this project here with four of the new aqua hues colors i have two blues and two greens and i'm going to be using the water brush that you get if you order the uh, choose your hues set you get this water brush as part of your order and uh, you just fill it with water give it a little squirt and some water comes out of it it's very easy to use and it's also easy to get paint out of the containers you just squirt a little bit of water in there and swirl it around and you've got your paint it's very fun very easy uh, this first blue color that I'm using is called Blue Me Away, and I'm just kind of adding color in random spots and just kind of letting it drip and get into the grooves of the texture here. I love embossing, and I, I don't do it enough, and this is something fun that I've been wanting to try, and I love how it turned out. And you could do this for a card. You could do this and punch things out and use it on a layout. Uh, so many different ideas that you could do. Uh, the other blue that I used was called Rock and Robin, and the two green colors that I have are Leap and Lizard and Green with Envy. And I chose these four colors because I knew that they would blend well, and blues and greens always look nicely together. Another thing about the Aqua Hues is you can add a lot of water to them and lighten them up, or you can continue to add layers and the colors are going to get darker. And that's what I'm doing here. And remember, there's no shimmer in the hues. The Aqua Hues are just flat color. And I love how this is turning out. I love that marbled look. I'm going to do one more card today. And this is another embossing folder. It's stars. And I've already got some uh, clear gesso on it. And I'm going to use some sprays for this one. I have a Spritz and Caribbean Sunset. And I just spray it on. And then again, again, I'm going to use my water brush to kind of smudge it around and add a little more water so it kind of uh, gets a little drippy. This is a matching color in Vibes. And this is called Mango Tango. And it's got a very pretty gold powder sheen to it. This last one is another Vibes. It's gorgeous. It's a light pink color. It's called Pop Art Pink. And there's a ton of gold powder in it. So when it dries, it's pink with this gold shimmer. And it is just so pretty. And I love these colors together. Just, I love pink and corals. And so this is something else you could do. And I love how it you can see the stars, the lightness and the darkness with the, with the paint. And how it goes in and between the texture there of the embossing. So this is just something fun. I hope you give it a try. I love the result. I've got some close-ups coming up. You can really see the gold shimmer there. It's so pretty. Anything gold is beautiful in my book. And then the hues with no shimmer. I love how they blended together. So I hope you give this a try. It was really fun. Thanks for joining us this week.